Torchix like this is Play Studios XL here with a new let's play of Mega Man X. Definitely one of my okay. This is actually pretty unique because for those who didn't know, Mega Man is my favorite franchise of all time, and ironically, Mega Man X isn't even in my top five because it's mostly considered of Mega Man Zero games. Fun fact: Mega Man Zero Four is actually my favorite game of all time currently. Well, I can't really judge until Xenoblade Chronicles X comes out, or Kingdom Hearts 3, which is probably out by the time you're watching this in the future. Well, present, but you know what I mean. But this is widely considered by many to be the greatest Mega Man game of all time. This is only my third favorite game in the X series, mind you. And the only X game I really played on my own, to be honest. But even then, let's get this thing over with. Okay, so it's actually pretty unique. Uh, you may have noticed already, because for one, I'm going to try my best to make the least amount of Ego Raptor references as possible during this. But what I can say is, I have to agree with him for one thing. This intro stage is freaking amazing. It literally has everything you need for Tijitos. I mean, uh... It's certainly a lot better than... What usually games have nowadays, because they literally spill out everything. Uh, you know what? While I go through this level, before I start this level, uh, I have to do a big notice. I actually didn't want to let's play this game at first. I actually wanted to play another Super Nintendo game. I may play that Super Nintendo game in the future, but the game I wanted to play actually was Super Metroid, which is another great Super Nintendo game, mind you. And, uh, I thought that game was too long, especially considering that I never finished it on my own. I actually never finished it at all, actually. But Mega Man X, on the other hand, I have. And so here I am, I'm playing Mega Man X, which, which is actually my favorite SNES game, if one does not count X3. Anyway, let's get a move on. I should probably go over... Okay, so, 
What I want to show you is pretty unique level design, actually. Oh, no, wait, that one. So, see this? So, you try to go back. Boom, you're hit. So, what do you do instead? One could say that you shoot it, but this was solely made to be jumped. Or you can shoot the fucker, I guess. Another one. Hey! There we go. So, we see this guy here. Uh, you can't jump over this guy. He's too big. Like Ridley. So what do you do? Shoot the crap out of him! He also is shooting those. Or not. So, you see this pit here. Jump! If you fall there, you'll die. If it wasn't obvious enough. You can also jump and shoot at the same time. But you knew that already. But like I said, I'm going to try to make the least amount of ego re after references as possible. Unless the title probably did it, if all I care. Oh, by the way, you can also charge your Mega Buster here. Or X Buster, whatever. Uh, hey! There we go. There's also a bunch of... Oh, crap. Okay, die. Okay, so, wait, first let me get rid of this guy. Oh, hey! Okay, good. Okay, let's get a move on. So, you keep going on, using everything you learn, and boom, this guy appears. Shoot the crap out of him! Yeah! Ah! Ah! Screw it, I'm jumping and shooting. Okay. So, you see this here? See this bumblebee guy? So, the logical thing to do here is to jump on a bumblebee guy, go to the wall, and then you slide. So, what does that mean? So, you go back, go there, jump over and over again, and holy crap, you can wall jump. But, and you can also get that item over there if you could. Just to show your skill. Like that. Wait, I have to need to check something. No, I don't have any. I don't have any sub tanks yet. I just want, I was actually, oh, and you also see these guys. See? Uh, no, you didn't see there. If I try to shoot them here, it just goes through their legs. So you have to jump and shoot to get them to show that enemies have certain sweet spots. And hey, what do you know, another bumblebee guy. So, shoot the crap out of this bumblebee guy. If he could, if he could die, and I didn't realize, I'm not freezing this level so much for the tutorial that it doesn't really exist. Why am I literally telling all you people what you have to do? Wait, that's what left players are supposed to do, right. But even then, let's get a move on. Like I said, you can just shoot that. Oh god, oh god. Okay, I honestly wasn't expecting that. Well, I was expecting that, but... Okay, crap, 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 crap. There's no way I'm going to be dying on the intro stage. Good. Good. Me no die. Me no die. Me no die. By the way, while I keep going here, let me to phrase something here. The music in this level, which by the way is called Central Highway, is freaking amazing. Hold on, I'm just gonna sit here for a moment. If these enemies can't stop respawning, I need to find a good spot. Good. Now, just listen for it for a moment. Freaking love it. Well, anyway, we get a move on. Yes, I forgot that was there. Also, we have this car guy. If he can respond, I actually want him to respond. There, I said it. Ride on cars. Now, can we get over? Can we get over this, please? 
I have to be completely honest, the thing that motivated me to make this episode of the Let's Play today was actually because I watched the sequelitis episode just recently. Okay, now riding on cars. See? I was doing nothing and I already beat her. Hey! What do you think you're doing? Good, I'll, st I'll steal your car. But buy it. Hey, that guy. Buy car. Okay, well, what was that lag for a minute? Okay. Oh, this is the thing that keeps dropping the cars, of course. Die car. But then. And then. Game, hurry up. And then. Suddenly, Purple Boba Fett. So much for the original designs, and holy crap, he's going after me! Holy crap, I can't beat him! See? He literally kicked my ass in that quick! You worthless piece of, of scrap metal. Did you think that you could defeat me? And then... What's that? Enter my favorite video game character of all time, Tiger Show from Xenoblade Chronicles, Freaking Zero! I just love this guy so much. Well, whatever. Back to start. Uh, I would explain why he's so awesome, but I'm gonna do that later on in the story, when he's more relevant. I guess I'm not powerful enough to defeat him. X. You shouldn't expect to defeat him. He is designed to be a war or machine. Remember, you have not reached your full power yet. If you use all the abilities you were designed with, you should become stronger. Dot dot dot. You may even become as powerful as I am. I'll, I'll scout ahead and, and collect as much information on Sigma's fortress as I can. I'll meet up with you when, when you get there. See you later. X, I know you can do it. And there he goes. And there I go. Shit, I just realized I need to keep track of all these passwords because I'm playing this on the Super Nintendo. I'm playing this on the Super Nintendo. Maybe I should have gotten it for Wii U now that I... Or Wii U. You know what, Wii U, that has save states. This is the stage selection. I know what you're thinking. No shit, Blaze! Well, guess what? Too bad. I'm telling you that it is anyway. And I'm gonna be using my phone for the duration of all of this because I need to tr keep track on passwords and know these guys' weaknesses and everything. Tired of all this beeping yet? Tired yet? Tired yet? Tired yet? Screw it, let's just kill Chill Penguin. Seriously, who doesn't go for Chill Penguin first? But, in sacrifice for that, you know what that means! It's everyone's favorite gimmick! Ice Physics! Hooray! Hey! Uh, if this guy can die... Okay, am I gonna die in the first section of the first level? Well, not first level, but... It's been said to be the easiest. Yeah, I am! Or not. That can work, too. Considering how many bumblebees are here, you'd expect there to be some sort of... Bee Maverick or something. There isn't. And I don't know why. It would have been so perfect. Can I get an energy tank, though? Seriously, game. Or not an energy tank, but... There we go. How come I'm sucking so bad at the first, first level besides Central Highway? Oh. Thank con thanks conveniently placed bat. It was appreciated, I guess. Um, 
If I can jump up here. There we go. X, just just keep doing that. Uh, and okay. Uh, you know what? There's one thing I would say. If I ever had a question of the day thing, if I could, I would make this episode be um what's your favorite franchise of all time? Because I because this is the episode and the let's play that's revealing my love for the Mega Man. But anyway, what do we have here? So you've come. X, I gave you the ability to choose your, your own path in life. And I hoped that the world would allow you to choose a peaceful one. But now it seems that you are destined to fight. Because I thought the world might need a new champion, I have hidden capsules like this one. If you find and, and use them, you'll be able to increase your powers beyond anything the world has ever known. Step into this capsule and receive an extra. Uh, oh yeah, Accelation, sorry, I didn't see that or no, Accelation system to boost your speed. Good luck, X. That there, everyone? That there was Thomas Light from the original Mega Man series. You remember him? He's dead. But either way, we have received this dashing boots thing, which introduces a major mechanic in this game, dashing. Now you can jump and shoot, while charging, then dash, and then boom! Gotta go fast! This is one thing that was really needed in the old games. Then again, what am I talking about? The only classic games I played were 2, 1, 9, 3. And I have no plans to go into the game. Don't get me wrong, I still love Mega Man 3 and... Uh, wait, what? I, oh, okay, I just found an alternate way to dash. You don't even need to press the A button for it. You can just do that. Okay, how am I suddenly going so good now? Is it because of the boots? I think it's because of the boots. Is it? If I can hit you. I feel like it's going back to me sucking now. Okay. Die! Good, give me the thing. Is there any is there any uh health upgrades in this area? I just realized. And hey, what do we have here? Ha! Ah. How do I get up there? How do how do I get off? Oh, is this where the help upgrade is? I feel like it is. Or did I skip it? I feel like I skipped it. Let me go back. I didn't take any notes on this. Oh god, I'm going back. I'm going. Bye bye. Bye bye again. That's it. I'm charging. That doesn't work either. Aha! Mech suit thing. Mech suit. Right. What the fuck? What was that? Uh, how did I end up here? Oh, it, it's just a mech suit. First, I need to punch the crap out of these guys. But before I punch the crap out of these guys, I need to make the shortcut here because that is definitely not where you find the health upgrade if there is one in this level. Like I said, I didn't take notes for this. Because I read. Well, I have plenty of notes for Super Metroid, though. Wait, I never take notes for the series. Well, for any series, really. I just do whatever the crap I want. This isn't the 100% run. Well, 
This one will most likely be. Well, either way, let's get a move on. Time to crash Chill Penguin's party! Maybe that- maybe I'll try to heat things up if I could! I would say that, but I don't have a certain boss's weapon. Wait. Wait. Get hit! Get hit! <laughs> Do something! I forgot what this does. Wait, what? Wait, what? What? How the hell? How the hell did that work? That's it, Chill Penguin. You asked for it. Ah! Oh. Get out, get out, get out! X, X! What? 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 Wait, what? 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 Um... Okay... Um... I... 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 Um... 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 I... Um... Uh... I... I'm not gonna question it. Uh... I guess we're gonna stop here? Next time on... Let's Play Mega Man X, we're going to kick Chill Penguin's ass? In the meantime, this has been Blaze Studios XY and I'm out of here? I need to think about something for a second.